What? The price of love? Yes, sir. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow. Tony, look at that boy. Tony. Eh, eh. Hey, hey. hey, boy. <laughs> I'm going to have a strong man, boy. I buy an offer. I can carry you over the river. Yeah. <laughs> you never give me that story, you know, boy. You got to get that story. What about yeah. this river? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Going over this river with a long trail. Let me hear that story. Well, here now. Can we do that later? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The man hungry. 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 Later, the price of love. Yes, Come in. Yes, Very good. We'll get a bill for you, don't worry. 38 years ago, I crossed the river with a wedding dress. Imagine that. Long veil going over the bridge. When she get married. When I hit the top, I said, Tony, where the house? He said, Look it over there. I said, oh God, Tony, I want to go back home. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hell because I'm married in Sawa, so I know that thing up a mountain and river. Yeah. I said, Tony, hold me. He said, no, 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 come, come. I will, I will pick you, pick you, lift you up and take you over the river. <laughs> the price you pay for love, girl. The price of love, boy. <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. Well, those days. Oh, look at that, Tony. He's slim, so he's trapped, but he's short still, you know. But did you not go to his home before? No, girl. I never know where I go in. I never know where I go in to live. You understand? Yeah. I didn't see Tony for three months, so Tony Louis. become like a stranger to me right. the day of my wedding, you know, because I didn't know what he looked like after yeah. three months. You know, <laughs> when I leave Tama, the last day I see her before we married, she had long hair. Uh -huh. on, our on our wedding day, she had hair. I said, but well, this is not the first time to put you I know, same thing happened to me, boys. Yeah, I want to never see cause you know, some relative I want to marry. I almost tell my brother, look, let me go home. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But you and I keep the same foot, boy. Yeah, but when I watch her say, now the height, mm -hmm. I remember the height was the same. I don't know what you're saying. Can I just shoot that tape forward? Can I just shoot that Mr. Ricky? Yeah, man, so I like it. Too. Like you just said, the price of love. This part here, I still have any car, and you've been in car time to go. You... The bride and the groom go in. I crying, I crying, I crying. You know, and then people like to cry plenty. And they playing this song. Um, sing it there. The, the wedding song. Tony, when's the wedding song, boy? Tony, let me hear the wedding song. Johnny Wale, do oh, la yes, yes. Kuchi, kuchi, kuchi la, 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 la. Rana. <laughs> Are there a girl you crying? You hear back now? That is back now. I'm crying. But he happy? Yeah. Because he, he get it from cab, so he go in and we run. <laughs> when I said, I'm going to the car, I said, oh, God, Tony, boy, where we going, boy? He said, let me go now, you're going to see when we reach. But when we reach, I said, Tony, but how far again? He said, a little bit again, man, no worry, we're going. He said, but so we're almost there now. He said, but here, what I have to tell you? You know, we have to cross our river. He said, oh, God, I want to go home. <laughs> It's not that hard, yeah. but that was tough for me because I never knew about mountains and, and, and river and all. I come, right. look I come from, you know, somewhere, you know. But well, we Listen. select Tony carry across this river today. Exactly. Well, Tony had to take me across this Tony. river. <laughs> Tony, 22 years later. Like, like, you want to scratch up with me up from there and pick me up? <laughs> <laughs> you were youthful then. Then. That was then. But you're stronger now. Look at it. Fighting with the flies. <laughs> no, but you know what? I was slim. Now she's not. I never regret. I never. I, I don't yes. have regret. Yes. Uh, uh, I could laugh and talk about this today. Eh? Exactly. Yeah, with all the ups and downs. And so when you got married, was there a, 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 what else called it, a lukuni in the house? Oh my God. But that was another time. When night time come, look, sir. So sh I be tired, we exhausted, so I go to lie down. And Tony, um, Tony didn't come in yet, you know. So then I saw uh, Tony outside, so I lie down in the bed. I saw this woman coming in. If you see the face, 
if it's the, oh god i don't want to say nothing bad but it was not nice um appearance and she came in the room so i but you were exposed to that kind of thing before no no all this is new to me uh -huh. all this is you new had heard to of any, me. anything I've, I've, before i've heard of it but i've never experienced this mm -hmm. so <clears throat> i said well maybe joke you know people making you know yeah, right right next thing i saw the woman put the the mat or the whatever on the floor she lied down there the side of the bed so i said tony but who is this woman he said i skaki um, I said khaki. I said, well, hey, what? I out of this room, you know? <laughs> I don't want to sleep for no khaki. <laughs> the Indian people call it Lukani. The Indian people call it Lukani. Every time you, you, every time you watch, if you only do so and you want to go to the bathroom, every time you raise up, yeah, she was a real look and you see these two big eyes watching me like that. I think they get you scared. Were you were accustomed to that tradition, that culture? Yeah, like well, I hear the say, eh? you know. Yeah. She wears like Tony t shirts, so you know. But any of your family who has ever uh, in, um, you know, experienced such? Uh, your you brothers? Uh -huh. So, wait, uh, no, I never really. Look I don't think so. Every any of them have yeah. I know it exists. Okay. Just look somebody come with a light on. In the same room. Somebody come into a light on in the room. Oh, yeah. 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 the bride and the room the first night. So, they come into the arm. Yeah, just story. They come into make sure maybe the. the, 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 the the, um, the... Well, I tell you, if I have a look on me, I hope she up to him. <laughs> Repeat that again. <laughs> Boy, if I have a look on me, I hope she up to him. <laughs> <laughs> you looking at me. What the jail is this? I'm married, boy. What's right with a hug up my wife? But what is, it? what is the concept behind you looking at me? To look. <laughs> <laughs> So why you think they put her them look at it? Yeah. It's because she going to look. Yeah, boy. <laughs> no, I, 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 I think you cannot have any um, martial um, contact. Uh, contact until, until the second Sunday. Yeah, until then After, or something. Okay, yeah. when, the, when, the, when the girl family relatives come and take her on the Wednesday, right. they take her back home for the Wednesday, and on the Sunday when you go to take back your, your wife Only then. from their home, that is it. You're, yeah. you're free with your wife. Mm -hmm. There's no more Lucanese, no more Pucanese. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's tradition, right? It is. And yeah, it's a tradition, yeah. But does it obtain still? Huh? Asisha? Does it, does it obtain, up, obtain right. still? Yeah, because why? So. Okay. Okay. why? Why it was Lucani funded? He said it's okay. They don't need a Lucani. A Hawk funded said that, which is the priest. He says, okay. They, we don't need, but still, I don't know for what reason they had this lady there like an owl. The <laughs> eyes were just gaping. Well, guys, I, w I would like to let you all know that I am available if anybody wants to look at me. <laughs> 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 No, but he, he don't have to be. He don't have to be a local. He could be a man, and he. A man, and he. He could be a man, and he. <laughs> Better known as a local, and he. Oh my goodness! This is ridiculous. No, but listen, that was. I don't know. My marriage was just a. Oh God! It was like a adventurous marriage. Yet not adventurous. Yet not adventurous. <laughs> But you know, when I'm married, I fight your plans. You know, I, I, I have to share this with my kids because I, I don't even think I told them this. And they would laugh. Well, okay. they would laugh. So they're going to be. Yeah, yeah they will the be amazed. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. But it, 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 was a, it was a very nice experience so that I could share this with yeah. other couples. But you know, today yeah. in the modern yeah. uh, world, that's not yeah. happening because. The um the couples you know they live together for a while then they will arrange for their marriage by planning their wedding their own the wedding. right way their own wedding How and they want it. and they will they don't say what colors they want or whatever they want how they want their wedding to be and who they want in their wedding but my wedding I could not do that I got married at the age of eighteen and my my wedding was really old school old school in that in the sense that in my grandfather days 
in my mother days where Tony's sister engaged him and and um, no Tony's sister engaged me I'm sorry Tony's sister engaged me and my brother engaged Tony which which I couldn't understand I couldn't understand that at all I I didn't kiss anybody. <laughs> <laughs> there were no kisses. There were no kisses. There were no kisses. There was no kisses. No kisses. What so so on that same day, they they arranged and put a date for our wedding. That same day, day of the engagement. Because the pundit was there, so I think we well, check in the book and stuff. And I know, I know. I then like we it. know that the wedding date would be April 14th. Then mm -hmm. why can't he? Mm -hmm. Very so interesting, we'll right? Very interesting. It, it, but it was nice ex, a, a nice experience with no food on a wedding day. What? No food on your wedding no day? No food on a wedding day. We didn't get no food. Um, on was my that side, planned also? Well, we didn't have time to eat on my side. But yes. he ate. He had something called sweet rice, which he really did. Daddy you know, when, he, yes, when he's so excited and all this kind of thing, you're not hungry, you know what I mean? Mm. But when you settle down now and you go on the, the, the boy side, then, then you, you want something to eat. eat. Yes. So I was well, so some hungry. Cutters coming through yeah, man. Think coming. Think yeah. for the back. I was so hungry. Yeah, think man. for the soul. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> fork. Think for the soul here, man. <laughs> what is that, fork? Yeah, man. Mm. Fresh pork from Fresh prices. Fresh pork, man. Fork, 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 fork. Look at fork there. But Louise, I don't believe oh, even in our wedding, I can't remember eating, you know. No? I don't even remember sticking the cake. Mm. Cora pork boy. Cora pork. Okay. What's your name? Wonderful. Oh God, oh yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it's right. Oh. Now come down. Yeah, no. Mm. Mm. You want to be a little bit of 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 a little Mm-hmm. Yeah, Sana. Correct. Tony. I couldn't wait to really eat some Trinidad pork. Boy. That's a hurry down. Yeah. That's a really good one. That's a hurry down, eh? As you said, try it. Yeah, Tony. Correct. You're hamburger, man. You win. Can't keep it, you're wrong. Mm-hmm. Listen, Raghav. It don't need no more salt, huh? Eh? Yeah. That's enough salt. Guys, you guys should come. Who? No. Uh, anybody from around the world, all the countries, different countries out there, and you guys want to come and have a line, just call Lasana Batis, mm. and he's going to make all arrangements. Look at this lovely curry pork. And this is not all. There's more to come. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. You should get he, a picture of the pot he on will fire man. Take a, a yeah, photo of the pot. He will arrange everything for you guys. Just, just US dollars. And the price oh. is right. US dollars. <laughs> US dollars is better? Yeah. Or pounds? Yeah. Or whatever your country carry? <laughs> what currency your country carry? <laughs> Very reasonable, but you know what? You will have a great time. Yeah, the river is yeah. beautiful, crystal clear water. We have two lovely friends here, two watchmen, <laughs> two dogs. <laughs> mm.
The price of love, boy, to me. The price of love. How's the price of love? You still paying that price? No, I think I Eh? I, I, that price paid a long time, man. Eh? Uh -huh. Yeah. Mmm. Wash up, man. Wash up, wash up. Wash up. Sonny, you did well today with the fire? Yeah. Yeah, man. I like the nice one. Mm-hmm. That fire didn't give no trouble. Yeah, what chicken? Yeah, yeah, two chicken. Look at me now. Sonny, I think you need to empty, you know? Hmm? Yes, need to come out. No, uh, no, not yet. No, I said it's hard. It's hard, yeah. It's hard. 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 It's Shanta and Tony have been our guests. We really appreciated their kindnesses, their generosities. And Lasana wanted to really give them a good day by the river. So far we have been on the bank and I can't say that anyone has gone into the water in any great extent, but it's beautiful. It's a lovely day, the water is crystal clear. On one of our videos, I believe it was another token of love that I tried to show to Louise. Someone responded about the difficulties they were having in their marriage. I really would like to do something to just encourage that person i doubt i could do it today the atmosphere is a little too you know too um too relaxed for such an for such a topic a topic but i i i really hope to get something done to be able to help at least offer some help. <clears throat> I'll just show you a little bit again. This is Cora River. Further up Cora River, actually. So I have been invited to return to the little group. Apparently there's some conversation I should tape. So I'm going to gladly step forward. No, I was just telling them when you're married, on the day of your wedding, it feel like the more you do for your wife, the more you feel like it. There's nothing you can't do. You, you want to do anything, lift, lift them up and run the mountain and run back down. Are you stronger than me, boy? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah that was the good days. No, not now. No, not you're now. smarter than that. No. <laughs> <laughs> I've become very no. smart here. Yeah. Oh, you drive up the mountain? I'm driving up the mountain, yeah. <laughs> Well, then she go first, and I hold and she and going up after. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, man. So, Shanta, you should have, you should have taken, you should have taken advantage of that. Oh, yeah. Say that again. I said you should have taken advantage of that. The man was willing to take you across the river. He about over the threshold, but this man was going across the river for you. Well, I'm sorry, I was crying over there. Exactly. So, you, so you actually walked across the river? I did. I did. No, there was, was there, a bridge. There was a bridge. There was a bridge. All right. So, we, so we, I thought I had. To, well, when he told me I have to go over the river, we have to cross a river. That's what he said. The, real, the bridge was not broken. Yeah. It, it was, was very narrow. narrow. Like that, that, oh, oh, like the table, table top there. So when he said. How for me to hold she hand to walk with she, but we had a walk. Right. Mm. So that, what are they doing? Yeah, because I was, I was asking him oh, on, the, on our way. Yeah. Oh. How did you, how did you walk? Let me see. Across yeah, that narrow. Hold hands like that and walk across like that because you got to. <laughs> yeah. You're just sleeping there. You're gone. <laughs> yeah. But it wasn't deep or dangerous. No, but um. Okay. About three, about three, four feet down the ground. That, 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 that time. That Half of a dress would have been spoiled. At this point of the moment, that was very traumatizing for me, right, Tony? Makeup was, my face was so beautiful with 
my makeup artist. Makeup went left, right, up, down, all over the place. <laughs> Oh, wait, uh, my face uh, uh, was in a mess! Oh gosh, you know something? When we go home, you must show me that wedding photo. The wedding photo? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, I started crying from when I when they started to play that song. So that What song was, was playing? What song? Johnny Wale Dula Hana. Tony help me. Oh, <laughs> I don't want say, to say, say the rest, say the rest. Yeah, but I don't know it properly, but ah. I know it's yeah. And help me, Azisha, what is this song they sing? The wedding song? What is what's the words? I don't know it. <laughs> Tony knows it, you know. Lance Tony knows it. He knows it? Yeah, he knows it. He word can for sing word? it. He knows it good, trust me. He, he can sing it. But you know what? That song is a very emotional song and I I up to know if I hear that song. I, I will feel emotion. So it was played. It, back it was played when you got to the house. No, when, no, when we were leaving home. my home to go to his home, uh -huh. they started playing. They started playing the song, right. and it was so emotional because you're leaving your parents' home to go in another home where you never saw. You. So let, let me ask a little question here, Santa. Seeing that that seeing that that song was um what about your boys when they got married what was oh, it like oh, for no. you as a mother-in-law no well they didn't have um a huge yeah. wedding like me mm -hmm. they just registered and i think eventually they will have they will plan their own wedding mm -hmm. because now it's not like long time days right. so they won't have they won't cry like how i cry oh oh yeah because you know now in this time couples live together they have children and then they have a huge reception you know in some time to come of their choice mm -hmm. whether they wanted christian hindu or whatever you know mm -hmm. so we just support the kids your parents just support the kids and they do their own stuff mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. in this time and age, this time and age right. yeah but in my time i couldn't do that okay okay you know so i had to go along with my parents mm -hmm. and my you know it was like but that's like um i got married at the age of 18. So but it was not an arranged marriage was. was it no my marriage was not an arranged marriage tony came at my home and asked for me okay because he saw me at his brother's home mm -hmm. so we met at a birthday party it was it was a double a birthday, birthday party, party louise they met at a birthday party birthday can party. you imagine that yeah, Tony, Louisa, yeah. Tony's him. brother birthday, where he passed away now, and it was Tony birthday, the same, both of them, the same day. So he What month is he? Tony's March 25th. March, okay. Mm -hmm. So uh, he saw me there. He saw me before, but I was small. I was like around 16. But now, um, when he came that day to the birthday party, I think he was ready to like maybe get a wife and settle down because he said his mom always told him it's time to get a wife it's time to get a wife mm -hmm. so he started talking we started talking you know mm -hmm. and then it wasn't too much but my parents never sent me alone anyway they always sent me so i went to that birthday party with my sister and my brother-in-law and tony was there and then we were all sitting together. They, they they get up, they went to eat at the table and Tony came over and sit by me because mm -hmm. I, I, didn't, I, I, didn't, I wasn't going to eat. So he came and sat at the side of me and we started talking and we got in a little conversation there and love kicking. Love kicking, huh? <laughs> and then the price love of love was kicking. paid. And the price of love was paid. But what do you think about arranged marriages? Right. They don't obtain as many, as much as they did long ago, eh? No, 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 no. Arranged marriages, a lot of long time people do arranged marriages when their daughter turn 18 in their home. Mm -hmm. And their son, they have an older son and, you know, he doesn't want to get married, but <clears throat> he's there. So I know, I knew this from my aunt, my dad's sister, because she used to do a lot of arranged marriages. Mm -hmm. And she did a lot of arranged marriages, you know, for kids that she took and taking care of, you know. Mm -hmm. 
excuse me, <coughs> she would hook up on um, like the boy and the girl and say, well, okay, I have a daughter, I have a niece, so I got, you know, mm -hmm. and she would do that. And some of them turned out to be very good. Some of them, I think, turned out to be, mm -hmm. you know, not a couple can agree with each other. But I guess most of But them, even outside of arranged marriages, like you know, in Christian marriages, a lot of them don't work, you know. Well, so even, it's just a, though, yeah, it's, it's vice versa because yeah. um, even though you you meet like okay, how Tony saw me, and sometimes they don't work at all. Mm -hmm. It it based on um, I think for your marriage to last like probably a thirty eight years. Is Congratulations. Love, you must love that person for who he are or who she are. Mm -hmm. You don't love a person for what they have, mm -hmm. but you love a person for who they are, mm -hmm. you know? Yes. Because if you love a person for what they have, mm -hmm. then that's not love. You no, just love what they have. That's right. So at the end of the day, when anything happened to that person, you're happy mm -hmm. that, you know, that person is gone. He sees what, because you really didn't love that person. Mm -hmm. And then it depends on how you treat your husband. You know, you would know how much. Some people just say they love, but some people, even though they they in marriage, they don't even know what's love. Mm -hmm. Because they just stay with the husband or the wife because they want to stay. Mm -hmm. You know, so it have some of them is like beat me, horn me, but don't leave me. Wow. It goes both ways. Mm -hmm. You know, the man abuse the woman or the woman abuse the man. You know, but horn me, beat me, but don't leave me because they don't want to be ashamed with family or friends for mm. the marriage, you mm. know, come to an end and divorce. And then it would affect the, the children, you mm -hmm. know, mm -hmm. but then the children grow in an abused home, you know, a yes. broken home. Right. And then they rebel when they get to a certain age. So it's not nice for your children, either. No. you know, it's not nice. You know what? I and Tony try our best and I wish. Like, uh, as I always said before, that a lot of young couples could learn from us and learn from you guys because we learn a lot from you guys. Mm -hmm. Even though we are 38 years in marriage, mm -hmm. we learn a lot. So it's never too late to learn. And That's every right. day you learn something new yes. as a couple. All you right. know? We learn to respect. You must respect your husband's wives. Please respect your husband's your husbands, a man is the head of the home. But husbands must respect right? their wives and too. And husbands must respect their wives. Mm -hmm. And with love. That's right. Honesty is the best policy. Policy, yes. You've Very. got to be honest mm -hmm. with your wives, with your partner. Mm -hmm. Because this is what makes a marriage. And then your kids can afford to talk about it. My kids, Tony's not perfect. I am not perfect. Yeah, I... But you know what? Mm -hmm. We are 38 years in marriage together. And we never let our kids down. Right? Mm -hmm. I have four boys. We got four boys together. No, thank you. Thank you very, very and, much. Hold on there. Lovely grapes. Thank mm -hmm. you, Azizra. And I think my kids... Oh, I think my kids will be proud of us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You know, there's a lady I, I mentioned a while ago yes. that I hope I could do something. Mm. Mm. Uh -huh. You're bad like Baji boy. Mm -hmm. No kapot, watch out on no kapot. No kapot, Nasana, but he's coming for you, boy. <laughs> Like Chatak Matak, you know. Chatak Matak. Body, body, body. Yeah, body, real body. Yeah. That's not practicing, no kapot. I'm watching all them videos, you know. You're looking at all them videos. I'm watching all them videos, you know, no kapot. You want to come in, boy? We have a lot in, in New York. You guys eat now. No, but I find this one eat good. Yeah, yeah. Very good. Mm -hmm. Very good. Mm -hmm. It's been good. Mm. Okay. You don't need this again, I right, Paul?
Okay. I will see you sometime. Mm -hmm. Will this walk you a little? Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. This one. Right. Maybe you could help me a little bit good with camera. that. Okay, sure. We having a good time, all the time. Antics, Mr. Batty, me camera. Yeah. <laughs> <Now>. <laughs> There's a lady who um, made a comment. She's 31 years married. Mm -hmm. She has two children. I need to help with this, huh? She has two children and um, now she has two grandchildren, 31 years married, but a very sad life. Wow, 30 years, the husband, 31 years in marriage? Yeah, the husband drinks a lot, it would seem, but they're still married, it looks like, and she's still honoring the vows of marriage. So I wrote back saying, you know, you've been very courageous and it's good that you are this way, but perhaps he has not found the the, the way to express his love, his love for her, for her, for his home. Maybe he has company that is not doing him any good. Well, um, now, what do you think about her status in the marriage, sticking it out, being unhappy but sticking it out? Okay, so sh I guess yeah. she loves her husband. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh. She loves her husband. Right. And she does not want to be. To leave him, you know, she doesn't want her marriage to come to an end. Um, do you want to sit here instead? No, no, no. Okay, so she loves her husband and she loves her children, she loves her grandchildren, she loves her family. Let me put it this way so she's taking as much as she can for her marriage to work, even though he's. Uh, he's drinking or he might be abusive I don't know yeah, she didn't say yeah but I'm just suggesting I, yes, I don't yes. know we, we, we really can, don't know we, all we the facts not judging a judge is a sinner so right. we're not judging right. anybody but there is some men that is very abusive when they drink and they drink a lot sometimes they have problems and they think that when they drink it will solve the problem mm -hmm. now we as women tend to nag our husbands sometimes uh -huh. you know when they come home from work or um well it go both ways but mostly the women right they nag husbands they might tell the husband something they don't want to leave it alone you know it depends on what they nag them for it might it could be you know on, on somebody outside it could be the drinking you know mm -hmm. keep on telling him about the drinking or maybe some other problem that they have in the home mm -hmm. you know there is likes and dislikes Mm -hmm. But I suggest that, you know, a lot of, right. um, 31 years yes. of marriage is not, uh, yes. it's long, but I'm 38, so they're pretty long, you know, what, they, what I suggest is that if he would like to talk, you know, and trash out, or both of them could talk and trash out their likes and dislikes. Right, right, right. But they can do it with, with love, you know, one has to be humble, both of them cannot be um hyper you mm -hmm, know mm -hmm. they gotta be humble but before they do that okay i will tell you about me if i have a problem and i'm scared to talk to my husband um thinking he might act up or he wouldn't like it so he will you know say well you know i don't like that or whatever you know whatever i will pray about the situation so if you have an abusive husband or you have a a, a husband who likes to drink um, I mean, I share it with a lot of people too, you know, mm -hmm. that are women actually. And if they open up to me, I will say, listen, number one is pray about the situation. Mm -hmm. When you pray about the situation and you put God first, sometimes there is a personal situation like in your bedroom you don't want to discuss. Mm -hmm. Right? Like your husband, he's not good enough for you, your wife not, you know, performing properly or whatever you know we get we're going old we go through menopause you know same with the husband they go through their little thing too but so sometimes they drink sometimes they drink from the day they get married they drink they don't want to stop you know but it, remember in her case it was an arranged marriage well this is what you have to trust yourself because you are married to this guy when you marry to this man or this woman, you become one. 
so both of you have to sit together pray about it first sit together ask the lord to touch his heart so he will understand how you feel right and if he have problem with you also you will be able to he will be able to share with you his likes and his dislikes about you right and you will be able to do that with him also because a couple of years after i and tony did this thing you know mm. and we worked on it we worked on it because tony if he drank at the earlier age of our marriage earlier you know early years earlier years when the kids were small a um, couple times he drank and it did, drinking does not agree with him so he would become very um, angry you know mm -hmm. and he would look at me as though i'm um, you know he's seeing something evil in me and then one day i told him i said is either you stop the drinking or we just separate mm -hmm. i gave him a choice mm -hmm. and i was really really serious about that mm -hmm. no joking so everybody looking at this you could give your spouse a choice I'm not telling you guys to do what I was gonna do mm -hmm. because everybody's different. Mm -hmm. Nobody's the same. But I give him no choice, and he only had like two beers. Mm -hmm. But he, he get he, he, his whole color changed. He got red, you know, and he he was you know. And look, he's one of he's the best husband, one of the best husbands in the whole world. Tony, yeah. take a bow, my boy. I compliment take him. Take a bow, my friend. I, Take him out, take him out. All him of that. Take him out. Yeah, he take him. a bow and hit me head here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he could cook, he takes care of me. That is wonderful. You know, we take care of each other. Very good. You know? Yes. And we, everybody have their ups and downs. But arrange marriage, it could work out. But you have to do the right thing. Not all and works not out. all works out. Not all. not all. Not all at all. Because sometimes the spouse does not want help. They don't want to work it out. A real marriage really, yeah. really is the more older people long time used to do it, not mm -hmm, now. That's why I just told it's them too me. much of a modern time to so that arrange wedding and marriages so your kids, your family do it. It don't work. But what we were saying, our marriage in 31 years is arranged marriage and <clears throat> the spouse is he's, he drinks. That's what you were saying, mm -hmm. he drinks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, Oi. So, you know, she, she was like having problems. So what I was telling him is that they have to like, they could sit and talk about it. Their likes and dislikes, right, Tony? Yeah, likes and dislikes. That's what we did, right? Yeah. We talk about our likes and because I, I was even sharing with him. Out. I was sharing, just sharing with him that you used to take a couple of beers. You used to drink <laughs> a little bit too. Yeah. And then I give you a choice that you know, if you have to drink and look at me like this in this, like if you seeing evil in me, if you don't stop it, is either you 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 choose the the alcohol or you choose me one out of the two because I couldn't deal with that. And what I choose? Me of course because we still together. Okay, there you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you. Now, because a lot of people have to be willing to work, especially <laughs> men have to be willing to work. Work on that. You have to be able to give up. If there's a person drink alcohol and can't handle it well then you'll always have problem in your marriage yes you will always have problems in your marriage yeah yes yeah, so because if alcohol is coming in between you and your wife cut that alcohol yeah no matter if it's beer rum scotch whatever and it's causing a problem with your married life mm -hmm. you got to choose because especially when there's children involved yeah that is, it's important yeah there's kids involved is a lot a lot you have to live for Yes. You've got to put your family first. So, you see me, brother? Mm -hmm. I love my family. I love my wife, my children, my entire family. So, I don't think it. You know, very good, very I good. I used to get on if you kill us if I think of it. Maybe you could talk to him first. I used to. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't have a he, problem he, if anybody wants to hit. take a half hour. He never you used to hit. Ahead. Yes. But if it's having a problem with your family life, yes. cut it. Cut it, cut it. Yeah. But you don't want to, you don't want to mash up your family life right, for alcohol. Yeah. And at the end of the day, you you will need someone in your life when you start to get old. That's right, brother. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And when you mash up mm -hmm. your marriage at mm -hmm. the early age, mm -hmm. your wife or your husband don't want to see you after that. Mm -hmm. Because yeah, chances are they may get someone else in their life. Mm -hmm. 
Well, it, go, it goes for the women too, you know. Not only the men, because there is women is drinkers and there is a husband doesn't drink. Mm -hmm. So it goes for both of them, the man and the woman. Mm -hmm. So, you must always, and I just always tell everyone, put God first. See God first in your life and everything will fall in place. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. I think I'm going to run out of some, of some charge now, okay. but you all have helped me because there's this lady okay. I needed to talk about her. I was going to do it later, but you all have brought it to the surface and I appreciate it. Uh -huh. So welcome. my friends, here is Tony and here is Shanta and glad to have them and they'll be soon leaving our shores, but we wish them all the best. Thank you so thank much. You so much. Appreciate that.